Cobb is a, an example of earthen architecture. Alternative methods for constructing buildings and tranquil settings. It's Gabriola's home and garden tour, where residents help each other. Bill and I decided to participate in this tour um, as a way of giving back to the community that we live in, to offer our home, open our home to our community, and um, also give people a, a sense of what natural building is all about. I support volunteer organizations on this island. I'm a, on, on another volunteer organization myself, so I know what it is to do fundraising. 100% of the proceeds from the Gabriola Home and Garden Tour go to PHC. People for a Healthy Community is a, a community-based non-profit organization. The tour involves 10 sites that we have this year, four uh, really distinct different homes and then six beautiful stunning gardens. We've owned this particular property eight years, but every year since it seems like it just keeps growing. Every year there's a little bit less grass. We haven't cut down all the trees, we haven't, uh, you know, we need the sunlight, but we still try to grow it into the salal. We used cob in our kitchen counters, the bathroom counters, as well as our floors on the main floor. We're hoping that people will see from our home that uh, natural building is very malleable. You can have a very modern looking home, you can have a very earthy, hobbity house kind of home, and that it's, um, there's something in it for everyone. Behind me is a truth window, and it shows the material that is used as insulation for this house. Just one of the interesting tidbits of information that you will discover on this tour. On the home sites this year, there are some alternative building architectural designs, uh, very unique, and uh, there's ponds. There's a lot of variety, something to interest everybody. We've got a south of France garden, we've got an English London uh, Wyoming garden if you can put those words together. We've got all kinds of exotic plants that we picked up at various uh, nurseries across the country that uh, specialize in plants from from places we've been like Peru and, and other countries. A lot of the methods used are based on really old traditional uses of materials that were mainly so sourced locally such as clay and straw and locally milled wood. We'll have uh, a book put together that will explain our process of, of building the home and what we did, why we did it. It's a, such a positive aspect for, commu for Gabriola community. June 24th is the day, 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. is the time. You can tour on your own or leave your car behind and get a guide through Shimena's Tours. For additional information, email or give them a call. Reporting from Gabriola Island, for The Daily, I'm Melissa Hall.